What we do know is that four people have been killed and the alleged shooter in this incident, according to police. We understand a total of 11 people were shot. We've heard from a couple of the hospitals in Jacksonville, including UF, the University of Florida Hospital there, saying that they treated six patients. Uh, five of them are understood to be in a good condition. One of them is in a serious condition. So obviously, uh, these numbers may change. Uh, at the moment, though, we understand uh, that four people died at this event. What we do know is that Jacksonville Landing is a very busy outdoor mall kind of place. It's in the center of Jacksonville. It would be very busy on a weekend. There are many shops and restaurants. It's where many young people tend to congregate, uh, especially on weekends and in the evenings. It's a place I've visited before. You'll find many families there, but this was not a normal day at that shopping center, of course. This uh, was uh, where, in one of the restaurants uh, inside this shopping center, was where this video game tournament, the NFL Madden video game tournament was being held so you could expect many more people than you would normally expect to be there on a weekend uh, in attendance particularly young people so certainly the sheriff uh, being very circumspect in the amount of information he's giving particularly on who uh, this uh, alleged shooter might have been and what the motivation was I was going to say doing there's lots of speculation obviously on social media and one of the US newspapers was already running um, front pages on this I mean do we have any idea about the uh, the motive of uh, the alleged gunman well some of the reports that we've been seeing uh, are that the alleged gunman was a disgruntled gamer of course uh, this was a place where there were many young people so uh, we've seen a lot of uh, social media accounts of what took place not only the video that you play but also many people live tweeting uh, the events as they unfolded inside that restaurant uh, at Jacksonville landing many people saying uh, that they were lucky to have escaped one person whose tweet I read said that they were shot in the finger uh, so we're seeing many different accounts we're hearing a lot of speculation about who this person may have been none of it uh, the sheriff will confirm for us but we do understand from multiple media reports that this was uh, who was somebody who's being described as a disgruntled gamer so somebody who may have already been at that event